Hey guys, it is the Andrew SG. Welcome back to Jupiter's Tales. Hey, so today we're going back to three green card dimensional hopping in this low difficult, still like Tom Mal agitation. You know the one they did last time? Yeah, the one that I really didn't like. Let's hope I actually like this tower, although I probably won't. It's worth it's worth a sh it's, this tower is worth a shot of my um, mood. A shot at my mood, but. Okay, I, I don't know what I'm saying. I, I I was like trying to say something there, but it just went off into a total nonsense. But yeah, <laughs> God, okay. So it's not dimensional hopping. People actually told me it was easier than Tom Mount Agitation. I'm not that sure, but okay. But let's see. Finally, advanced towers. Tower dimensional hopping has a design style and a creativity style, but not a gameplay style, so I'm going to not like it. Okay, probably not, but not recommend for mobile by three underscore XW. Let's go. Holy crap. Oh my god. I'm oh I'm getting overwhelmed by what's going on here. The music's too loud. But X. What's X? I don't think I see X in the chat, but I'm like, where do I even go? Um, what the hell? X, go figure something out with this X. Okay, maybe not, maybe we don't go to the X. Maybe the X means wrong. See, I, I didn't have to do anything with the X. Okay, cool. So what the hell is going on? But yeah, this is how dimensional hopping, so... Yeah, this is reminding me of Tough Environmental Pain, just a little bit modern, more modern, I guess. Yeah, six seconds. Oh god, oh god, oh god. Ooh! <laughs> that could have been bad. Okay. But cool. Alright, a little bit of a walk thing there. Hard. Okay, let's just ignore these kill breaks. Who cares about them? Oh, can't ignore the shoving platform though. But we just got past it, so yeah, okay. Cool. Oh, already almost the second floor. Wow, okay. Yeah, these, 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 this this tower's a little, it's a, a lot like something you might see in Orby King Remastered. Just, um, with JTOH kit stuff. Okay, this is a moving platform. Cool. Nothing really to say. <laughs> I've got nothing to say. It's just, yeah, it sounds pretty not bad so far. I kind of like it. You know, compared to the other Zone 3 towers, I've not really liked any of the Zone 3 towers so far. So, this is the best one so far. The second best is, is either Tower of Xanthophobia. Or tower six feet under. I know a lot of people don't like how Xander for it, but I I feel like the others are actually worse. Was it supposed to go here? I think so. Okay. Second floor though. Hey. Oh, I don't think I'm supposed to go here. Oh, you 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 can I guess, but it doesn't really lead you anywhere. <laughs> so not here. Wrong wrong way. Oh 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 oh. Okay, we can't actually fall off. Okay, that's good. We can't actually fall off. All right. Oh god, we have to fit into the one stud. Oh, I actually did fit. Very nice. Okay. Okay. Hit hit. Nice. Oh no, I bounced off. Oh, that. Okay, but continuing on, let's not get screwed over by the robot physics. Woo. Okay, right. Yeah, so far this task pretty good. Actually, sort of enjoying it. Yeah, only robots physics screwed me over once, which is probably like ten times lower than usual. Oh, yeah, okay, I'm bad at these jumps. Oh, as you know, this is I'm not. I'm I'm actually normally bad at these jumps if they're hit hitters. I'm not too bad if they're not hit hitters. They just slanted. Okay, these are somewhat hit hitters, so I gotta be more careful. 
Okay, especially that one. That one's kind of a heavy to kid me, Jesus Christ. What a one star. A one star. Then I got on it. Yeah, I got on a one star. Okay, that's a little bit of a difficulty spike there, but I won't mind since it since I didn't fail it. I mean, yeah, it is slightly hard for a difficult difficulty tile, but it might, it's just one time. I don't mind. It's okay. Okay. Ooh, speed. Speed! Oh, I nearly failed that. Okay. It's playing like the Sonic sound, um, soundtrack. Green Hill Zone Remix. Yeah, okay. Oh, I missed it. Right, it's okay. I've got tons of time to do this. 94 seconds. It's more like... It's more like 120 because of the server lagging a bit. Okay, let's actually not miss the moving platform this time. We're gonna wait since we got quite a bit of time. And yeah, ooh, there's a sign up there. Sign up there. Let's take a look at what that says later on. Okay. Okay, yeah, these reps are kind of hard to make if you do it at that kind of angle, cause cause of Roblox physics, it kind of cause it, it's kind of hard to change the directions you're moving that far. So, uh, yeah. Okay, good arrow there. Now we're a bit confused. See, get yeah, this 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 tower. I I'm gonna bet it got a high score for gameplay, so it's just not enough for a star. Cause honestly. I and I, I do I can see why the design and creativity is good, but yeah. If you fall back on the so that's a sixty second speed boost to give you a chance of getting back here. So that's a there's an automatic sixty second speed boost if you fall down to the previous floor. Okay, I don't even know how the creators do that sort of thing, but I guess it just is. It's probably just an invisible speed giver. But I do not know how. And wow, okay. Right, what am I supposed to do here? Okay. Oh. How am I supposed to get it up there? Oh, I just made it fall off and it worked. Okay. But now how am I supposed to get to there? That looks like a very difficult yeah, that looks like impossible. And it still can collect true. Oh, maybe I don't go there. Maybe I go here. Ah, that makes no sense. Okay. I think the button was for this. Okay. Alright, alright. Things are not doing too bad right now. Oh. Oh, what? What was that? Oh, that was, that was can't collect false. Alright, continuing on, yes, finally, continuing on, alright, Jesus Christ, uh, uh, okay, that is difficult to do, my god, alright, Okay, this is not too bad. And I'm about to reach the 20 minute mark. Woo, 20 minute mark. And yep, 20 minutes. Okay, but I'm gonna guarantee this video is more than 20 minutes long. God, imagine if it's like 19 minutes long. I'll look like a joke if it's 19 minutes long. Okay, it probably won't be 19 minutes. It'll be like 23 maybe. At least, like, it, sh it shouldn't be. Like, it, uh, most of my videos are just really long because I spend a lot of time on the video. But, like, come on. How to do this, how to do that, blah, 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 being confused and everything. But, yeah. Ooh, fifth floor. Okay. Oh, God, that could have been bad. Okay, elevators. Right, yeah, you know this tower still isn't too bad. These are the these are the type of like 
Oh, well, well, these are the type of clan objects I don't really mind, you know. But crap. Okay, please. <laughs> okay, how the hell am I supposed to do this? <laughs> um, okay, whatever. Nope. That's no crap. Okay, okay. Come on. Oh crap. Nearly failed. Oh! Yes! That took so long. That jump took like. God, freaking 10 quadrillion years to do. My god, what the hell is this part? Oh my god, help! I think I'm good now. Holy crap! Oh my god, what is happening? <laughs> okay, right, no, can't go there. Oh my god. Ooh. What's that do? The hell is that? Okay, I guess we can't enter that yet. Island of Punky! <gasps> oh my god, Island of Punky. Holy crap. What is that? Is this his favorite jump? What the hell is that? Can I jump up this? I can get on the frame actually. <laughs> I can get on the frame. But. Oh my god. Cool, I guess. Actually, this is a high jump. 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Yeah, it's 10. So it's technically a little bit of high jump. And there, right there, is Shirdal sure of Laptop Splitting. His very nice and favorite tower. Okay? And there's the microphone from the JTOH commentator thumbnails, I think. And then this is his freaking top hat and B. But um I think we should not we should um actually continue on because yeah. The mirror looks a little off. Oh my god. Okay <laughs> I think this is the dimensional hopping thing. Welcome to Sinalezo All the Wastelands, the guy who named this place is an interesting fellow. Yeah, who's the creator of this tower? I forgot already. Yeah, I I'm quite shy. Okay, whatever. I don't know. I I I cause normally I do that like sort of thing where I like name the creators and stuff and all the information before doing the tower. Oh crap! And then I went the wrong way. Okay, I can, at least I can do that. That's okay. That's okay. All right. I can freaking barely see where the. The tightrope bridge, what the hell? God, okay, what am I supposed to do here? Oh, it's one of these push boxes. Okay, I can't go there. God damn it. Crap. It's not too bad, I, I did think. Um, can, I, can I touch these now? No, I still can't. What's the point of that color changer? Oh, unless it's just to press the button. Maybe that box, maybe that color change is just to press, it's just to press the button. You know what, that makes a bit more sense because normally when they have the color changes is because it's a puzzle or something, but not in this case, not in this case. But we're at the sixth floor now, we're at, and uh, in a different dimension. So I, that's pretty cool. There's a safety net. Oh God, be careful if you fall down in, in yeah, it's game over. I mean, you can try and laugh clip out. I think you can definitely laugh clip out if you if you are if you're really in a bad situation. But not me for now, at least. Okay, where am I going now? Here. Okay, cool. So yep, that's a soft lock part. That's made on purpose, so it isn't really a bad. Game design. They even they even notified you. They said, you know, you're gone if you fall in here. I'm gonna guess it's gonna be a tons more soft locks in this second 
second dimension because um because of how this is safety net here at the sixth floor. Um but I think we're at the seventh floor now. Okay, where the hell is this? I'm just gonna go here. This is alright. I don't exactly know what's going on, but oh god, fifteen seconds. Go 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 that's like half a stud. Oh, I didn't know that was an out jump. Oh we passed it. Great. I kinda paused there for a while. I still passed. Alright. That's good. Wait, can I can I Oh I try I try to do something cool there but I don't think it worked. My stud ties on. You know what? It's fine, I'll just go check the footage to see how high it is, but oh okay, I tried to do something fancy there but it failed so no nah, that that didn't work. Alright, so I don't think I can do this jump, so we're just gonna ignore that, and we're not supposed to do that jump anyway, so let's just not do that. Maybe I might get kicked for exploding if I if I try to do that, so no, 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 no. We, we won't do that. Let's not do that. Right. Little kill break part. No one cares. I think that's kill break lag, actually. Yeah, that's quite a bit of kill break lag, so... Okay, right, but um, where the hell am I? What the? Well, at least this part isn't like a part where you can really fail unless you do something really wrong, but it's just okay, cool, I guess. Oh, this is a part you can fail if there is no kill break lag, really. But since there's kill, there's quite a bit of kill break lag, I'm probably not gonna die there, even if I stand there. For a few minutes, and I probably won't actually die when I use my healing items. Okay, whoa, sitting stuff. I thought these were like trusses for me, but I guess not. Oh, okay. Cool. Very unstable platform, but still cool. Ooh. Bomb. Set to blow up the weird thingamajig. Let's blow up the weird thing on the jig. Oh, <laughs> well, oh crap, we're here again. Wait, is that? No, okay, this is the last time we're gonna be using this part. Once you hit the button, go back to where you found the bomb. Yeah, cool. Ah, oh, I thought I would fail there, but yeah, just respawn that thing. Oh, okay, we're good. Right. We're in the eighth floor now, I think. Okay, let's turn the music up. Okay, this these things seem to tell you where the X pushing platforms go to, which I find to be um very nice. If I'm gonna say so myself, very informative. Are these ice? Okay, these are ice. So I'm just gonna spam jump on them. There's so many freaking things in this tower. I'm getting a bit overwhelmed. This is just, this seems like another clan object showcase to me. So the ice platforms aren't actually clan objects. I think they're just platforms, I guess. Because ice is a thing you can find in the kit without doing any sort of scripting whatsoever. I mean, not kit, but you get what I mean. Like, um, a default Roblox block. Okay. Oh crap, we're going back again. No! I want to go there. No. Crap. Please. Okay. Right. Alright, this is good. Alright. Whoa. What the? Shadow part now. Yep. This is what I told you, everyone. This is just a weird clown object showcase. Ladder there. Where do I go now? Here? Okay, sure. Safety net. Why is there safety net here? If this was difficult, difficult there'll be no safety net there. But you know what? Okay, right. Oh! I don't know what that did, but... I'm supposed to go down back there now? Where the hell am I? Crap. 
Maybe this is why this is so small. Wait, unless oh, I'm, I think I'm supposed to go here. Yeah, okay. That's probably why that was a so-called safety net. That wasn't really a safety net, but it's really just a platform for you to progress. Oh, I nearly felt that. Not so good at those. Okay. Right. God dang it. These slanted things are making me nervous. Because I'm not good at them at all. Alright. A little short part here. Ooh. Oh, we just got teleported. This is the ninth floor now. Ha, we're getting close to the end. Please. Okay, jump boost. This is normal speed, um, but a little bit of a jump boost. Cool, very cool. Oh, and there goes the, the jump boost section. We're back to normal now. A little bit of a... Oh! What was I to say? A little bit of unstable platforms there, but I kind of got distracted and walked off or something. I What the hell happened there? Okay. Let's see where I can pass this. Okay, I can. <laughs> it was easier. It was much easier the second time. Okay, yeah, but these these obstacles are really making me nervous. But okay, right. Let Let's continue. Let's Let's continue on. Pretend nothing happened. Can these jump boost things quickly activate? These take way too long. Like. God, those take a whole 15 years to activate. But alright. Right, past that now. What's this? Okay, uh, the, the, those are just non solid parts. Yep. It's very typical stuff, I guess. Oh. Hey, you made it to the final part of the wastelands. Nice job. Just know the landscape from here now is a little different. Yeah, it's all like. Um, it's all like all white. Well, it was like pink before. Why is it white now? Okay, but we're at the last floor now. This is this is where it. This is where I fail and cry forever. Hopefully not. Oh my God! Whoa, good and bad. Oh my god! Ah, oh, that's that's lagging my game. <laughs> that's that's definitely lagging my game. Oh wait, the end's right there. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Go 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 go! And then he fell off the tight rope. Woo! Oh, yep, that's it. We did it. Woo! That was very. That was some. Um, again, not a bad tile, but. That floor five jump with the spinning platforms that took me like three hours to get past. So, <laughs> um, let's be honest, I really don't didn't don't like that jump at all. But other than that, this sounds pretty good. Also, notice, well, okay, for for one that I broke the game because it, the daylight kept switching around. And, okay, but not anymore. It that it happened again. Why does the daylight keep switch? What what's causing that? Okay, but, um, yeah, this tower is pretty good compared to the others, let's be honest. All those clan object towers are pretty, just, crap to me. I, 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 I don't, I rarely understand them. And they seem, like, very, very like, somewhat luck-based to me. I, it's just, seems very, like, crappy obstacles. But, luckily, um, luckily this, this tower was actually fine, except, um, for that floor 5 jump. It will actually be like the best tower I've ever played so far if it wasn't for that floor fight jump. Still think tower xanthophobia is the best I've tried so far. But yeah, okay. Um that's that's it for the comments. Um thank you for watching I guess. Yay. What's the next tower we're doing? It's it's the it's the it's the Citadel. Uh, Citadel tricky situation. So this is the easiest Citadel in the game. And it's not really a citadel, it's like 14 floors or something. So, uh... It's like, yeah, it's like 14 floors, which I know it is a citadel. 
but it's like it's just only four floors more. What what, what like it's not like still that lots of spring because you know, um, it, it's seventeen floor. Actually, it's fifteen because two is two is the basement, but fifteen you can actually see a sort of a difference. Fourteen, thirteen, twelve, maybe, maybe not. Actually, I'm not sure how many flaws the citadel has. I, I don't, I don't actually know. So let me see. How the hell did I get on that thing again? I think I go cracked. I think I go here. Oh, okay. The, I, I didn't mean to go there, but I actually meant to go to the psychologically unsafe towers, and the citadel will be up here. And I missed it. <laughs> I think I should I shouldn't move. I think that's bad. I shouldn't be moving in the cannon or something. Okay, crap. I don't have my speed boots anymore. No. I need my speed boots. I'm wasting so much time on the view just to try and get to the citadel. I just wanna see how many flaws the citadel is because I remember it was not more than twenty flaws because that that will be way too long for a difficult difficulty setup. Unless it's like really easy jumps most of the way. But I don't think that's that's what the citadel is, okay? I'm gonna be proven wrong if I'm being honest. What? I'm not, not flung out the map. Ooh. <laughs> I'm just getting flung out the map. This the bros broken cannon ever. I literally got like flung out the map all the way there. That's not supposed to happen. Also, Sashara Junior is in the server, cool. But, um, he's probably like asking whether I'm recording or something right now. But I'm just ignoring him. He's gonna like feel very sad after I have re released this video, but oh well. Yay, didn't fling me this time. Don't miss, don't miss. Yes, oh, the, the Sildar was right there, but it's fine. Alright. Freaking Citadel, where are, where are you? Yes, Citadel, okay, right. So the Citadel is 14 floors, yeah, that's correct. It's 14 floors, eh? I, I, I was like thinking it was like somewhere between like 12 and 15, but I kind of forgot it's 14. Yeah, 14 isn't really that noticeable if you compare it to a normal tower, as long as it's not side to side. Yeah, it's not that noticeable. But. But I mean, it's still a Zelda, I guess, so cool. We're gonna be trying that next episode. I spent like god four, five minutes just trying to get to the Zelda, talking about and everything. Enough time wasted on the video, so I'll, I have to do the outro now, okay? Thank you for watching the freaking video. If you enjoyed it, don't forget to like and subscribe, and yeah, if you want to. So. Oh uh, yeah. Anyways, um, as always, don't forget to kill Fanny and goodbye.